the format of being robot. Everyone knows about the nostalgic TV company, Class Geek Supo. The one that's made Rugrats, and known for being a famous logo. However, there is one logo that is truly messed up. It was a perfect day, and I was washing the dishes. I later went out to the front door. When I opened it, I found a weird VHS tape no one has seen before. It was called, Rugrats.abi. I was confused at this moment. I never ordered anything, I said. I then took the tape in, popped it into my VHS player, and got it ready. It then showed the Nickelodeon logos, and then it went to the episode. However during that time, there were a list of six episodes from the show itself. I was very happy to bring my nostalgia back. After watching the six episodes, it played the credits like it would usually do. The music playing in the background was the instrumental of the theme song. The credits then took about over 20 seconds to end. After that, it played the Class Geek Super Robot logo from 1998, like it would usually do, but it was off. When the hand placed Splat's mouth, and when his eyes came up, he said, Class Geek Super. But in a glitchy voice. It then showed the original Class Geek Supo logo. But instead of the boing sound effect, like in the original, it had a sound of a computer crashing, which scared the life out of me. After that, the Nickelodeon Haystack logo played as usual, and then it ended. I was so speechless after what I saw. I then took the tape out and put it in the closet. The next day, I contacted Nickelodeon and Class Geek Supo about the logo, and they said that it was made by Ted Carrington, used was known to be making loads of lost episodes and media. That tape will always be remembered. It will always be. Thank you.